Hey guys, welcome to my review of Miles Morales The Ultimate Spider-Man Issue 5. So far I've been loving this series and I have high expectations for every issue and this issue definitely delivered. This issue did not have any action in the entire thing basically except for like two or three gunshots and that is all. So it's very hard to write a comic book with no action but they definitely did it and it was a really really good and intense issue. Miles is gaining new allies, which is quite interesting actually, and we keep on learning new information every issue, and there's other like enemies that are in the background, but we don't know who they're working for, and there's, there's so much going on in this issue, but you weren't confused at any time, it was just really interesting, and you don't want to stop reading, you get really excited when something happens, and like me personally, I can't wait for the next issue to come out, but I don't know, I can't really fault this issue, even though there was no action in it. I thought it was really, really good, and I hi highly recommend not only this issue, but the entire series so far, and even go read the trade paperback to the old Ultimate Spider-Man or old Miles Morales. It's a fantastic series, and I, I love it a lot, and I like I said, I highly recommend it. You should definitely pick it up and read it, and if not, just read this series. It's really, really good, and that is all for now. I'm going to give that issue an 8 out of 10. It was really, really good and interesting, and I highly recommend it. That is all for this comic book review. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe for more videos. I'm trying to reach 100 subscribers by the end of the year. And I would really appreciate if you subscribed and helped me achieve that goal. <clears throat> Once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.